on the table, the 24-year-old Manu Tucker with a whole lot more experience than Manu Shah. What a crazy point. The recovery, again, you do not have to hit the ball over the net. Manu Shah from way down low and wide. Watch this. Could go around the net. Does he? Plays it just low, clips the net on the way over. Steady backhand, Manu Shah fashionably late to the party, but he's got a point and is only down by two. was got that in Manu Shah. Yeah, the positioning here, taking that forehand from way out on the backhand side, leaves himself exposed, and after the patterns. Uh. Yeah. A snapshot. Yeah. What a response here. The power comes in, cross court, and Manu Shah steps around, drills it. And Manu Tucker's right there waiting on the other side. Style matchup here. He turns the corner. The side spin on this one. Mana Tucker taking a piece out of the side of that ball as it curves and bends out to the forehand. This is very tough to chase. In this battle between brothers, it is Mana Tucker that comes out trumps. He's defeated his doubles partner. Due to love and given you Mumba the perfect start. Oh, this combination. Forehand topspin does it. The full stroke in Manu Shah finishes strong. Yeah, it's time for match number two. You Mumba Titi have Sutirta Mukherjee coming to the court up against Reet Rishya Tennyson. And in this rally, Sutirta showing her superiority in the speed game. Oh, crushing forehand, the spinning backhand, and the drill on the forehand side. Short pitch smack out of reach. Once again, turned and burned. It's an invitation, it's a worm on a hook. And Reek takes the bait from under the table. I like this, right into the elbow. Reek goes backhand to backhand, constantly changes it. A little wider to the backhand, and as soon as Sutirta moves, hits her on the forehand side of the backhand. Six on the trot. How has she done this? Wow, wide into the backhand. This is danger going right into Sutirtha's backhand. Clean backhands. And that last one faster, deeper. And way to that corner was enough. Oh, way off to the forehand side, taking her chances on the chase. But a forehand takes care of business from the baseline. and a bullet rally takes the backhand out of reach 15 shots and the final shot was untouchable it's a fast furious fizzing with spin yeah! this was incredible yeah! the miracle girl is off the mark and she has beat Sutirta Mukherjee once again. This battle coming up with Manav Tucker and Maria Shao versus Bernie Such and Manu Shah, the mixed doubles. That'll be match number three. Uh. Uh. Oh, Bernie twice in this rally. From under the table, the amount of side spin that she put on that second to last shot she hit. And then the finisher out of reach.
perfect placement here as Bernie jams it up. This angle out of nowhere, Bernie from the backhand court drives it out of reach on both wings. She's confident and comfortable. The arc on this ball, this was quite an extended rally too. What a finish here, Manu shot over the bridge that is Bernie. She pulled the Zhang Jika dropping under the table and dodging his teammate, finishing, taking responsibility into his own hands. Boy, was he ready for that. The third ball was right there inside the baseline. Pointing that goes on. So Bernie pointing down to the ground, meaning this is backspin. They've been swept away. Hamana Thakkar and Maria Shaw. There's pressure on Quadri Aruna's shoulders this season around, and he's up against the T-Rex of the Ahmedabad SG Pipers. Smart play, this one from under the table does. Just as Guadiruna is doing right now. Oh, step around in the short side of the table. Full commitment on this turn, way outside the table to play this. Slaps it back, that's Guadiruna. Perfect placement into the backhand. Quadri with a big recovery. Oh, that backhand. The save to the backhand corner first, but the bend on this last backhand from Bardet is mind blowing. Defense barely covers the wide one, gets a slightly more passive shot. Vicious forehand by Quadri Aruna. Quadri does it, drops it short to the forehand side, and he takes the match, kisses the ground. It all boils down to this one. Maria Shao has a work cut out. She needs to win all three games. Kill shot. Perfect serve to set up that kill. Oh, clever. Just found that placement, didn't she? Oh, it all pays off. Steps around Maria Shaw. Long serve, and she takes control. She saves her team from defeat. And that body sucks. Oh, Maria Xiao behind the table. What a backhand by body sucks. Up to on a head to head has been seen. the doubt she had in that first game and emerges victorious as has been the case usually against Maria Shaw and the tie is right in front of you